Roland, that's a brilliant victory today, isn't it? Yeah, this different class to be fair. Uh, we knew it'd be a difficult side. Uh, they're horrible to play against, but uh, I think we stood up to the challenge very well today and it's good to get a clean sheet and get it off three points. As you say, a clean sheet is brilliant. It's something which hasn't come around too often for us this season, but I guess since you've been in the side, it has been coming up quite a bit. So is that is that is that you? <laughs> uh, no, nah, it's everyone. To be fair, I feel like the boys from the front all the way to Geordie, I thought uh, we started off well and um, we defended well as a team and we did the horrible stuff, which sometimes we haven't done this season. So it was just good to get a good base and good platform to build on and to go and win games. In your short time already with the back three, there's, there's been quite a bit of chop and change, hasn't it? With yeah. a few suspensions and injuries here and there and obviously had you at the AFCON. So has that been quite hard to almost settle in a little bit because you, you're changing who you are or is, is it not that big a deal? Um, a little bit, but I think like there's a lot of quality in the squad. Uh, I think whoever goes and starts is capable of going out winning the game and we've got good subs to come on to win the game. So, uh, yeah, it's difficult at times. You want to get a bit of rhythm, a bit of familiarity, but uh, we trust each other and we know we've got boys pushing us on the bench and ready to come on if, when they're called upon. Today was obviously your first game back from the suspension. Yeah. A bit controversial. We won't really yeah. talk about it, but how is that coming back from that? Is it a bit... Are you a bit, almost a bit worried that maybe the lads are going to play well in your ab, in your absence? Uh, not really. You, you want the boys to go out there and win, isn't it? Because we're in a good position now. Yeah. We need to win as many games now until the end of the season. Uh, not really. Just know if you get the opportunity, you just go out there and do your best, really. And um, yeah, you, we, it's a bit difficult because we're building momentum mm. from that suspension. But it's football. Just got to go with it. Obviously, you've been here before, yeah. a bit a while back now, but on, on a different loan spell. How, how's, how's things changed there? It's obviously you're coming into it this season in a bit more of a, a positive atmosphere, I guess. Yeah, it's obviously it's a different squad completely, and um, but yeah, it's completely different. I feel like the fans are right behind us, and it's more flip, uplifting, and we're giving them something to cheer. So hopefully, long may it continue. It's what we were backed by a brilliant crowd today, yeah, three, almost three and a half thousand and f over three thousand home fans. That must have really spurred you, you lads, on today. Yeah, definitely. Especially when you're one nil up and you're holding on to a lead, uh, it's nice when you can hear them cheering every challenge, every tackle, and then we got gone on and got the second. So yeah, they definitely push us um, towards the end of the game, and we're going to need them now to the end of the season. And it'd be great to be fair. And it must feel really nice as well, having the attacking quality in front of you. It must feel a bit reassuring that to know that if you're doing your job, you can rely on those lads to score because no matter who we've been playing up top, they've all been getting goals, haven't they? Yeah, I think that is a good team. We've got boys, on, like I said, on the bench as well who can come on and change the game. But like, well, I feel like we're comfortable, we know we're going to score. So hopefully just keep the doors shut and win as many games as possible.